Olamide is the only person in this industry that I've helped artists get to the top without expecting anything in return. Olamide, also known as YBNL Boss, has single-handedly brought many young talents into the spotlight. Some of those talented artists have also grown to become big stars and fast-rising stars in the music industry. Olamide is indeed a kingmaker in the music industry. He founded the Yahoo Boy No Laptop Nation, famously known as YBNL Nation, in 2012. Today in this video, we will look at the numerous music artists that Olamide held put in the limelight. Coming in at number 15 is Lighter. Lighter, whose real name is Babatunde Rahim. Him is one of the beneficiaries of Alamde's selfless act. This young man used to be identified as a YBNN artist and it gave him much needed exposure. Although it was said that he left the label following a disagreement, Lighter left YBNL telling Olamide he had someone who wants to sign him and he requested for his blessings. Alamde, however, unfollowed him on all social media. Lighter's breakthrough single with YBNN Nation, Time, featured vocals by Olamide. His other songs include Mona Lisa, Hold Me Down everybody and many more i really respect them as senior bro because like all those people like i've been listening to their music for a very long time oh um, Ashake Ashake and and Ashake. Ashake. you respect Ashake and fireboy as senior bros so much like since 2020 i think because Ashake drops a bang out in 2022 but yes. people don't really listen yes. to it and also like at number 14, we have Yomi Blaze. Yomi Blaze, whose real name is Amok Bolan Hall Sodik, is a Nigerian rapper and songwriter. He's known for his versatile hip hop music style and has released popular songs like OK, Dance to Eat, and Hot Like Fire. This young rapper was also discovered on social media by Olamide and it blossomed his career. He was signed to YBNN Nation in 2018. His other songs include Bangushe, I Not Forget, Jordan, and many others. At number 13, we have Victor. Victor, whose bed name is Victor. Victor Ali Boade is a prominent Nigerian singer, songwriter, rapper, and dancer. He's another music star who benefited from Olamide's goodwill. He rose to fame and his song enjoyed airplay after he got signed on the YBNL record label. He was introduced to Olamide by DJ Any Money in 2014. With his good looks and immense talent, Olamide took him in and featured him in some of his hit singles. His song include Skibi Dad, Prodigal Son, Wasted, Osamudia, and many more. At number 12, we have Chinko Ekun. Chinko Ekun, whose real name is Oladipo Olamide Emmanuel, is a Nigerian rapper and songwriter. This is another star who many might not know was helped in the industry by Olamide. He got signed to YBN Records and enjoys street credibility and massive airplay as a result. Some of his songs include Ebo God, Wefun, Shayo, and many more. He, however, left YBN Nation at the end of his contract. At number 11, we have Papenanzi. Papenanzi's real name is Okpe. Yemi Kayode. He left fans with a hit song, another one for the road, due to his affiliation with Olamide. The music star created an anthem illegal with YBNL Buzz's help. However, Papenazi has not left music and focusing on his spiritual journey with God. He is now reported to be a pastor. Some of his songs are Afrobeat to the world, Amazing, Necessary, and many others. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. This is the day that the Lord has made, and we shall rejoice and be glad in it. This is another time. For we to share the beautiful gospel of Christ, to share the word of God with you, to share the word of righteousness and salvation to you. Number 10, we have Picasso Rap. Picasso was born on Mogbolanho or Labo Day. He's known for his exceptional lyrical abilities. He was discovered after his freestyle videos made the round on social media and he caught Olamide's attention. <laughs> He was signed into YBNL in 2018. The youngster used to be a street artist but rose to fame after his association with the YBNL boss. He announced his exit from YBNL in 2019 with a special note of gratitude to Bado. Some of his songs include Got You, Rest of Mind, Ify, and a host of others. At number 9, we have Temi Awosa. This talented young woman was signed to Olamide's label in 2015 and was known as the YBNL Princess. They met on social media and the rest is history. She got her first big break in the industry after joining YBNL. However, Temi and Olamide eventually fell out and it became apparent after she dragged him online. She left the label in 20. 
2020. Some of her songs include Afefe, Holy Water, Bami Dele, and a host of others. At number 8, we have Naira Mali, the British Nigerian singer, songwriter, and rapper, was born as Ziz Adeshino Fashola. He used to be one of the top music stars in the country with one of the biggest fan bases known as Malians. His career took center stage after his involvement with Olamide. In 2018, the YBNA boss featured on his song It's a Go, which ended up being a pivotal moment in his career. This song served as an official single for the Super Egos during the 2018 World Cup. Actually, his initial breakthrough occurred in 2016 with Kosiwere, a track featuring YBNA boss. Some of his songs include It's a Go, Jackpa, Y, Kosiwere, and more. Mobad is just a normal guy. I've, I've basically always seen myself in him. And most songs he dropped is always rapping something to do with Nagamali, you understand? So I like I don't see it. So you're a big Mali fan, is that what it is? Yeah, sure, I'm a Mali. Are you? <laughs> I like that. Yes, yeah, true, I'm a Malian. All right, what about the man with the best name? Zinoliski. Zinoliski. Zinoliski is talented. He sings and rap like it was just so weird to me. So I'm thinking, whoa, I need the word to hear this guy. Okay. You know, I need them to hear him. At number 7, we have Zlatan Ibile. This energetic singer was never signed to YBNL, but Olamide, no doubt, helped push him into the limelight. The Aleye singer, Zlatan Ibile, needed to leverage on a more established artist to break into the industry. It was Olamide he featured in his song, My Body. In an interview, Zlatan noted that Olamide inspired him in the early days of his career. Zlatan once said Olamide gave him a free verse in his song, a kind gesture he will never forget. Some of his songs include Oganigwe, Tenboto, Alei, and a host of others. Hey, that way, Yoni. I think really good. Zatan, YC, Dutchman, Young John, Fuse, <laughs> Fireboy, Ashake. You know how many people who show? There are all of us. My son, first song, he called me for food for Instagram. Come, he took me to another state. Till I was recording, I didn't believe I was going to record that song. It's changed my life, but it changed my career to today, bro. <laughs> me, I've helped people. But I mean, we, just, we, we never say anything about it or talking about it. He will never say one thing. At number 6, we have Liu Ketch. Nigerian music star Liu Ketch, born Keshuru Olola Day, took the music industry by storm with his street dance style of music. He was signed to Olamide's record label in 2014 and has since become a prominent figure in the entertainment scene. While confirming his exit from the label in 2016, Liu stated that YBNL remained a family to him. The young sister revealed that Olamide helped him beyond measures that was agreed in their contract. In one of his interviews at 2016, he has said, it is true that my contract ended but about two weeks ago. My contract with YBNL was for two years but that is the business side to it. My contract included three videos and one album but Bado went out of his way to shoot about five videos for me. Business or no business, YBNL is family and we always be. Olamide according to Liu Kesh remains an unforgettable hero for him. He has the following songs to his credit, Ibile, Efe Joku, Ishe and more. At number five, we have Portable. Though many have described Habib Akikiola, famously known as Possible's Rise to Stardom, as that of Grass to Grace, and it wasn't without Olamide's support. After popular dancer Pokoli introduced Portable to Olamide, Olamide featured on a remix of Portable's song Zazu Ze, that turned out to be what thrust the, the controversial single into the limelight. Portable also shared that Olamide generously financed the music video of the song, highlighting Olamide's selfless support. Olamide by Though the YBNL boss has undoubtedly influenced his controversial Nigerian musician's game. His support made Portable become a household name in the country. As a result of this popularity, Portable has gone on to mingle with big stars in the industry. Some of his songs are Zazu Ze, Akoi Grace, In Year O Two, and a host of others. See you later, Mide. You know what I said? Baba come from London, come help me. That time I didn't do that. Facts. You know why they cry? Every day. I never see anybody, you know why I cry? Because don't say nobody don't help me like that. Hmm. They don't pick me. Ah, my word, they are me. Well, you are good, though. you are good to go, Lanza. Oh, help. Pick me. Drop fast, bro. Now, if you say you help me, put on for platform, oh, they share money. 
Let's see, yeah. At number four, we have Fireboy DML. Adi Damola, Adi Folayan, professionally known as Fireboy, is a proven talent making great waves in the music industry. He's undoubtedly one of the top artists at the moment. The singer who was signed to YBNL in 2019 spoke about how Olamide helped him when he had the writer's blog while recording Playboy, one of his albums at that time. In an interview with Spada Magazine, he said, I started making the album in late 2020. Along the line, I had writer's block, which happened to be my first creative block ever. I panicked. I thought I had lost my mojo. I called Olamide, my mentor, and he said, relax. It's your first time. I know how it feels. You need to change your environment. Thereafter, came a suiting to the emotional panic he had. The Peru crew now went on to say in an interview with The Punch that Olamide was the one who reached out to him. He explained how much Olamide believed in his dream and said he wanted to make things happen for him, an offer he couldn't resist. Fireboy recently bagged his first Grammy nomination alongside YBNA colleague Asake. Some of his songs include Peru, Champion, Like I Do, Yawa, Sere, and more. At number 3, we have Bella Smoda. Bella was born Abiola Ahmed Akimbiyi. He's a singer and songwriter. Okoli was also one who introduced Bella to Olamide. In 2019, Smoda featured Olamide on the remix of his song Vision 2020. The collaboration helped Bella Smoda to gain more acceptance in the music industry. According to Bella, Lamde played a pivotal role in the song's production, covering all financial aspects, including the music video and handling the promotion, essentially propelling him to success. His songs are Cash Up, Evident, Ohima, Philo, and many others. Coming in at number 2 is Adekule Gold. Adekule Kosoko Gold's success story is incomplete without Olamide's contribution. AG Baby, as he is fondly called, started with his lover boy style of music but has not proven to be the very versatile with how he had evolve with time. Shedding light on how the self-proclaimed Bado impacted his music career, Adekule Gold once said getting signed to YBNL took him to London for the first time. He concluded that YBNL changed everything for him and that he is forever grateful to Alami Day for all the support and inspiration. Some of his songs are Party Not The Stop, High, Sina, Ire and many more. Look at this, not my boy. Adekule is not my boy. Victor is not my boy. They are my brothers. We are family. They are supposed to live their life. They are not supposed to be enslaved. This is not colonial era. This is 2016. <laughs> Democracy to one now. Could there military era lawa? Could there be colonial era? So these guys they are supposed to live their dreams, live their life. If you want to show people love, show them love. If you want to support people, support them. Don't do it for one or two things all because you want to hold them down. You know what I mean? I'm just supporting my guys, supporting people I believe in, and let them go live their dream, do what they want to do. I don't choose their singles, they choose their own singles. They live their dream, they do what they want to do. All my own is to support whatever they want to do. So, we are family for life. Coming in at number one on this list of the 15 artists helped by Olamide is Asake. The Sumba sensation was born Ahmed Ololade and he had once written on Twitter, one come from Olamide and everything changed. This further reveals the impact Olamide has made on his successful music career. In an earlier interview with Saturday Beat, he also stated that being signed to YBNL was a miracle. Ololade Mi Asake went on to say one of his friends, Yemoli, played his song for Olamide, he liked some more and they did the remix together. After the song and video were released, Olamide asked him to come to the house and casually asked, would you like to join the family? Asake confirmed he was blown away with excitement and took the deal as fast as he came and it remained one of the best decisions he has ever made. His being nominated at first time Grammy nominee also came under Olamide's YBNA record label. His song include Lonely at the Top, Ome Ope, Bandana and many more. Yeah, we did two. Okay. In one night. Two songs Tra in one yeah, night. Trabaye and Sungbalaja. Oh, okay. Yeah, Olamide played the bass in Trabaye though. Oh, interesting. Yes. You know, a lot of people don't even know what that man can do. I don't know. I don't I don't want to, I don't want to talk about my boss too much. You get <laughs> <laughs> But a lot of people don't even know what he can do. Like like he has a very pure energy. Like even if you don't want to like stand, he can make you stand. But if you enjoyed the video, kindly hit on the subscribe button and like. Click on the end screen on your left to watch the top 20 richest young musicians in Nigeria.